Hi guys and welcome back here to Drone Emotion. Well, in today's video we're going to be talking about the DJI Mavic 3S, its release date and of course its specs and what kind of upgrades can we expect to see from this brand new drone from DJI. But before we get started with this video, if you're new to the channel, welcome here new and to keep up to date with any upcoming DJI product, whether it is the Mini 3 or the Air 3, you already know this is the place to come for all of the latest updates and info and also we're currently in the road to 10,000 subscribers so if you're watching this video and you're not subscribed yet well I invite you to go ahead and join the Motion family League. we're less than 2,000 subscribers away from actually reaching that goal let's try and make it happen before the end of the year guys so without any much further ado let's just go ahead and dive right into today's video which is going to be quite exciting well you might remember our video from a few days ago where we talked about the arrival of the Mavic 3S now this was confirmed thanks to our good friend Deals drone in Twitter now he has been a quite reliable source for quite a while now and he's had a pretty good accuracy when it comes to DJ leaks and rumors and well just today he surprised us with the release date timing and of course the specs that we can expect to see in this new Mavic 3S guys so let's go ahead and take a look at his tweet so there we have it guys and you can see it says the following rumor says DA will be developing Mavic 3S which will be released in the first half of 2023 the telephoto camera will become one inch CMO sensor and in addition to that we're going to be getting live view upgraded augusting Four and with 4G cellular as a standard. What do you guys think? Without a doubt, this looks absolutely amazing. First thing first, we've all known and seen that the health in sensor on the second camera of the Mavic 3 is really not the best. We've, we've seen that it has a lot of grain and it's really not the best quality and it looks like DJ is going to be fixing that and they're now going to be adding a one inch sensor in addition to the micro four third sensor that we already have on the main wide camera so that is absolutely amazing in addition to that we're, we're going to be getting oxygen 4 which i just can't imagine the kind of transmission strength we're going, to, we're going to be getting because with o3 plus we already have a crazy signal strength so i can only imagine the kind of power that this new strength signal is going to be bringing in addition to that we're going to be getting looks like 4g cellular transmission as standard something that we don't have with mavic 3 worldwide if you want to do that with mavic 3 it is only available in asia for the rest of the world we cannot use it but it looks like for the mavic 3 it's going to be avail available worldwide and that is something that i'm quite excited about and of course release it guys unfortunately it looks like we're going to be having to wait for january 2023 so that is basically a little bit over a year away so basically 12 months away before we actually see the release of this brand new drone from DJI guys remember this could be a cheaper version of the Mavic 3 but seeing that we're gonna be having a one inch sensor for the second camera that makes me a bit worried that this drone could actually be a bit more expensive hopefully that is not the case and this is a more cheaper version of the Mavic 3 and if that is the case this drone will sell much much better than what the Mavic 3 sells have been in the past few weeks and of course we don't have any information regarding the controller but I am expecting to see a brand new controller because what DJ did with the Mavic 3 giving us the Mini 2 controller was absolutely unacceptable in my opinion and I think this was even disrespectful, giving us this controller and DJ did not even bother to paint match it with the Mavic 3 aircraft color, which is a darker shade of gray. So hopefully we get a brand new controller or at least this controller with an LCD screen with telemetry. That will be absolutely amazing. So that is everything we have so far, guys. Our good friend Dill Strong keeping us updated. And he's been quite reliable as, have, as I have mentioned before. And as soon as we have any more new details on the Mavic 3s, don't worry, you're gonna be hearing them here first so make sure you subscribe and turn your post notifications so you don't miss on that video as soon as it goes live here on the channel so that's going to be a wrap for today's video guys thanks so much for watching and this is Emotion. sign out